Hey everyone, it's Sarah here. Today we're in our hoop house and we're going to talk about cucumbers. So cucumbers are an awesome vegetable that you can grow at home or in your garden or in a hoop house structure like this. Now we grow the seedless variety so they don't have seeds in the vegetables themselves but you can grow seedless for seed, seeded varieties as well. Seedless varieties are nice because they don't actually take a pollinator to help them create fruit. So in most cases, you need some kind of pollinator, either a bee or a ground bee or other wasp to create a fruit. But in this case, you don't need them. So it's really nice for a greenhouse setting. And the nice thing about seedless cucumbers too is that they're a little bit softer skin and they have less spines on them. So we trellis our cucumbers in a hoop house like this. We trellis them up on strings so they're off the ground and they grow nice and straight. If you have them on the ground, they'll tend to hit the ground and then curl so they won't be perfectly straight, but they're still perfectly edible. Now, the nice thing also about seedless cucumbers is that because they don't have seeds and they don't need to be pollinated, we can net our greenhouses, which means we put insect netting on them around the outside, because the main pest of the cucumber is actually the cucumber beetle. And what it does is it actually um, stays inside the flower while it's flowering and it'll destroy the flower but it will also um, create marks on the cucumber. So for example in this cucumber here what it will do is when you harvest it you'll notice all these white kind of marks around the top. Now the cucumber is totally edible but it just doesn't look really great. So what we do is we can net put netting on the outside of the greenhouse to make sure that no cucumber beetle can fly its way in. But that being said, also pollinators aren't able to fi find their way in either. So that's why we grow seedless cucumbers in our greenhouse. Now you can also grow cucumbers outside, and those are typically seeded cucumbers, like uh, pickling cucumbers or slicers. But again, because they're outside, they have lots of opportunity to be pollinated by other pollinators. So I hope you guys found this a little helpful. Heidi and I say hi today and um, have a good one. Till next time. Cheers.